Hello, good morning everybody. I hope you can hear me. I'm very pleased uh, to be here uh, again in front of such uh, honorable audience. Uh, that's the second time I'm making a presentation here at this forum. Two years ago it was about uh, the rules and the requirements that the uh, uh, ECB had put in place uh, to define what the cash handlers have to do to recirculate banknotes. And what I would like to do this year is to recall a bit uh, these uh, rules and requirements, but also to uh, provide you some insights on the development of the local recirculation uh, in the Eurozone. For that, I will first uh, give uh, a short introduction on what is the Euro area, um, and also provide some figures uh, on the cash circulation and also on the counterfeiting situation, just to give you a a broad overview of what is going on in uh, the euro area. Uh, second topic will be the requirements for local recirculation, what it is about in, uh, in Europe, uh, what are the development uh, of the local recirculation in the third part, and finally I will speak a bit uh, about the next generation of euro banknotes, euro series 2, and in particular uh, the impact on the local recirculation. What is the euro area? Um, actually, the euro area are uh, 17 member states who are using the euro as a, as a currency. Uh, the last one who joined is Estonia in 2011. Uh, in total, it is 331 uh, citizens, European citizens. Um, and what is very particular in this union, it's that we have very different countries from very large, like uh, Germany, France, Spain, uh, Italy, to very small ones, like Luxembourg, Malta, Cyprus, um, and of course, all these, uh, all these countries, they have different histories, different cultures, which means that the cash cycle is very different in all of these countries, which is one of uh, the difficulty when trying to define common policies. Uh, all these policies, they are defined uh, by the 17 national central banks under the umbrella of the European central banks, and in particular, uh, I am in charge of all the policies related uh, to recirculation processing of banknotes in the euro area. Let's have a look now to what is going on in, uh, in Europe in terms of uh, cash circulation. On the left, uh, you have uh, a graph showing you uh, with a blue curve uh, the uh, amount in euro which is circulating, uh, so the circulation in euro. Uh, and you can see that from 2002 to now, uh, end of 2012, uh, the growth has been very significant in terms of value. Uh, and especially now, we are reaching uh, 900 billion euro banknotes in circulation, uh, which makes the uh, euro, I would say, a trillion uh, currency, a bit like the, the dollar, which means that the yeah, euro is really becoming like the dollar global a worldwide currency. Um, the other curve, the pink one, yeah, red in this case, that's the growth, the yearly growth. And here also it's very interesting to see that from the beginning uh, of the euro in 2002, so completely here on your, uh, on your left, uh, so the growth is continuously decreasing 